hello friends good morning i'm here again with another video in accounting modules we talk about the journals what kind of journals are there to useful in the accountings because accounting is a very useful module for any businesses so let's gonna see how we can select the types of the journal we can implement on accounting modules so let's go directly to the reflector database so here our reflector database if i am clicking on accounting modules as you can find out on the dashboard all type of journals are there as i am selecting right now favorite over here once i remove it so all type of journals are available here it could be the customer invoice the vendor invoices exchanges bank cash people expenses point of sale everything so if you can find out from dashboard from here also you can go to the configuration and you can find out journals once you click on journal you can find out journal from here as well so let's select the first journal about the customer invoices yeah i can see this customer invoices i'm going to click on add it on that to see how it reacts so type would be the sales and the company it's already selected over here we are the default income that the number of the income that i actually i already say about i can change it to any time of course we have this you know dedicated credit note sequence we require on that and the source code which is inv so this is how actually customer invoices look like we're gonna see the next general which, which is a vendor bill so vendor bill is about again the same as just like a customer invoice the type is the purchase type and the default expenses would be the number of expenses that we actually selected and sort code would be bill because it's all so whatever the sequence number has been generated in the vendor bill it start with the bill okay let's select the next one miscellaneous operations of course the, it is a, again the same it is this type would be the miscellaneous so all the general type we can see over here we have the general entity the sort short code would be misa we have an advanced setting as well that you can lock the post once you create a bill or invoices then after you don't need to change you can't change the entry so that is how actually it works for so let's see the next general it's exchange different is again it's a exchange difference is about the miscellaneous activity so because that says the type would be miscellaneous we have the bank as well the all the bank account details the account informations the bank number the suspend account the account number bank feed so you can have a payment configuration which is a manual it is a electronics it's the outstanding would be maximum this number of amount method would be the manual and the checks so this is how you actually manage your bank journal as well let's see for the next one which is a cash one again the same as the general entry the cash amount and the profit amount and the loss account source code would be like this so all the general entries have this kind of entries you can directly select on i'm just back on the general as you can see you can also uh changes let me say if i want something uh, i don't need a exchange differences so i just uh, drag it down select it and i just take it down so all the generals that i actually i require it comes over here of course the all the generals it will come on the gen, you know general ledger so it will reflect on the accounting module in the general ledger so this is how general group as well but right now we don't have anything but you can create a general as well let's say i want to create a new general i'm going to create a new general let's say the new general would be the salary okay the type of course the type would be the miscellaneous and the source code i would just write say it will directly have a default company which is san francisco and i can of course have the debit account and i can select a bank account as well and i can select a credit account so i'm going to just save it so once i just save it i create a new general entry which is salaries okay as you can see the salary over here i'm going to put it over just after a bank so i'm just selecting on it it will reflect like this so this is how you can create a new general but i would suggest uh, let's say it don't make 
too much generals or too many generals in it let's say if you have a sales different region so don't uh, i would rather suggest do not create number of the sales generals let's put it on a general one region and you can create on the sales team wise that would be a more easier way so this is how you you know accounting modules you can select a generals or create a generals thanks for this video we'll see you on the next one bye bye